It is hard to explain why I have a passion for the outdoors and why I am fanatical about hunting. It feels so natural to me that I believe the answer should be obvious. Of course, the answer isn't obvious to everyone. Most people understand my love for the outdoors, but many ask me why I voluntarily go out into the elements to date the lives of animals. That is a hard question to answer, not because of the lack of an answer, but because there are so many reasons why I am motivated each year, each season, each hunt. What is it that stokes the fire which burns within me? As I have pondered the answer to that question many times, I keep coming back to the thought that the true answer is anticipation. Anticipation is multifaceted. The initial facet is anticipation of reward. It is easy to recognize our anticipation for reward. Conservation, herd management, food, and trophies are just a few of the rewards we reap through hunting. While these are the most practical aspects, they are only at the fringe of why I hunt. There is also anticipation of experiences. Our core passion is fueled by the anticipation of new experiences each time we step into the arena. A grunt, bugle, moan, gobble, and cackle all send the heart rate soaring. But if we are honest with ourselves, the simple snap of a twig interrupting the deafening silence of a calm afternoon is all it takes to trip the instinctual process of preparing for the kill. Anticipation is what heightens that moment when the twig snaps. Have you ever seen antlers appear through the brush only to raise your binoculars and see it was simply a light-colored bush? Me too. That is anticipation. It is anticipation that adrenalizes each moment as if it will be our greatest experience ever. Whether you're in the Chugach Mountains of Alaska or on the outskirts of town, you can create incredible experiences anywhere. Whether we recognize it or not, the anticipation of memories is the most compelling. Experiences only live for a moment. Memories are etched forever in our minds. Memories are what we keep, what we take with us. Memories are what fuel the stories we tell for years to come. Memories of misses, blown chances, bad luck, and poor execution produce far more stories than the trophies that hang on our wall. The awe-inspiring sunrises which pry away the darkness as the woods comes alive have created some of the best memories I could have ever asked for. The countless hours of thought, planning, preparation, and training throughout the year fill us with anticipation and make the moments of field that much more intense. The hunt, the memories, the anticipation, and the hours spent outdoors enjoying God's handiwork. Those are the treasures. The kill is considered the goal, but oftentimes the kill can be an anticlimactic conclusion to a hunt or season, especially when compared to the journey it took to get there. My primary goal is not to entertain. I am here to inspire, to compel, to create a fulfilled life in both God's eyes and mine alike. I choose to spend my time outdoors. I choose to spend my time hunting, preferably with family and friends. If your routine doesn't include being in the wilderness on a regular basis, it's time you rewrite your script. <laughs>